bowl of bread or bread bowl, bread yep, basket, yep. dinner rolls, appetizer, appetizer. This is the whole damn oh. meal right here, okay? We talking the main course. <laughs> All right, Joe, we ready for this? I'm ready for all of this. So we have three boxed TMNT, two vehicles, one play set. We'll go over them all. So first of all, we've got the Ninja Grappler, right? So this is 1993 Playmates. And Joe, I think you know, right? You know, you realize this was a remake from another toy line? Definitely a remake from the 80s. Yeah, so the toy line was called Rats. Robot Anti-Terror Squad by Tomy. <laughs> Somehow, Playmates gets the rights to this mold. I mean, if you look at it, yeah. it really doesn't have like the TMNT vibes no, at all. not at all. A little more like He-Man, right? Yeah. It definitely has like that 80s aesthetic. If so. this was real TMNT, there'd be like a toilet seat or something. Yeah. Yeah. So 1993, they get the rights to this thing. They pump it out. It's an okay vehicle. I don't think it's one people look back fondly, but the art suite. I mean, you got the movie star Leo. That's my favorite part about the box. Super Shredder. So this is right around the time of the Secret of the Ooze. It's probably on VHS when this thing comes out. Yeah. 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 Cool, right? I mean, the fact that it's here and it's sealed. Sealed. Like, this yeah. is the main thing, guys, for this video, for the three things we're showing off. It's the boxes. These boxes are insane. Super nice. Oh, I see a price tag. All right, Joe, time to guess. What do we think this thing retailed for? The Ninja Grappler. 1993. 93. How much was it setting you back? This looks like might be a Target price tag. I'm gonna not Toys R Us. I'm going to say $19.99. You're close. This is $22.99. Oh. So I bet you at Toys R Us it probably was $19.99. Yeah. You know, Target had to get their extra couple bucks. That's cool. So that's like the uh, the appetizer, yeah. right? Yeah. And then here comes the... Uh, the meat. What comes in? Is there something between an appetizer and a main course? Okay, this is the, this is uh, the side salad. This is the this is the uh, basket of bread. Yeah, yeah, yeah. To get free. That's the dinner rolls. And then this is the appetizer. There we go. Oh, this thing's beautiful. So this vehicle, unreal, right? This yeah. is 1992 TMNT bubble bomber. So yeah. mutant military. Dude, they were all in on military turtles. They were. Dudes, when battling the foot, my motto is keep your feet planted, except of course when you're in the air. Which brings us to the Turtle Bubble Bomber. Our Bubble Bomber drops smoke-filled bubble bombs. Boom! A really awesome jet with really awesome bombs. And that brings us to another great vehicle, the Sewer Sand Cruiser. Turrets rotate, makes gunfire sounds, that'll get the foot flying. So dudes, remember, a good turtle general never finds himself in the soup. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. I hate soup jokes. We talked about it on our pod, Time Blaster Toycast. We talk about TMNT every other week, yeah, right, Joe? absolutely. We're not huge military guys, but when you get the TMNT influence mixed with the military, you right. get something like this. You get a cool bomber jet that literally shoots smoke-filled bubbles. <laughs> yeah. That's which is a, unreal, right? It's the foot's weakness, apparently. And you think about it, you're like, how does this... I don't even remember how this works. Obviously, you can put bubble mix. Yeah. So you're getting legitimate bubble mix from Playmates. So it must be some type of bubble mix that allows the bubbles to fill because they're going to fill with smoke. It says smoke bomb oil included. Crazy, right? That is crazy. But the concept, I mean, if you're a kid, it's awesome. So there's this is like a trigger. Yeah. You're flying it around on your hand. You engage the trigger and it's going to literally shoot bubbles out of it. And when these bubbles hit an action figure, they're going to pop. And you're going to have smoke. You're going to have that little burst of smoke. So it's really cool. This is a val valuable vehicle yeah. in the box, especially a box like this nice. Dude, the corners are great, it's really. It's very, very beautiful. I like this thing. Did not have it as a kid. Joe, no, you? I did not have it. I don't even remember seeing it on the shelf, yeah. honestly. Yeah, I don't think I saw this for the first time like, in person until maybe five years ago. Right. But never saw one in a box, let alone a box that nice. Bowl of bread, or bread bowl, bread yep, basket. Yep. Dinner rolls. Appetizer. Appetizer. This is the whole damn oh. meal right here, okay? We talking the main course. <laughs> Everyone you know can feed <laughs> on this, okay, ready? This is gonna feed the whole family. Look at oh this. Oh my God. This is like once in a lifetime stuff. To get a Technodrome playset, Complete is crazy nowadays, yeah, right? Yep. Like the last complete loose one we had was like 500 bucks. Yeah. And it was, I mean, it was nice, but so then to get a box Technodrome on top is insane. But this isn't just a boxed Technodrome. This no. is a factory 
sealed boxed technodrome. Insane. I mean, never been opened, right? It's just Man. wild, right? So the guy I meet that we get this from, and the story is he bought his son these toys in the early 90s. Yeah. His son wasn't interested in opening them. How are you not interested in opening the technodrome? Put them in a closet. <laughs> 30 years go by, he opens a closet and he has this. He has like probably the world's most cleanest, beautiful That's insane. boxed technodrome ever. Wow. I don't understand. I don't get it. I don't get it at all. But I mean, we all know like this is this is the kid that like everyone wants to be. Oh my gosh, yeah, look <laughs> at that kid's setup. Where's that kid now? Dude, I don't know. Hopefully he should he's... recreate that picture is what he should do. <laughs> but this art. Like just this Dude, art. Yeah. Look at it, man. I mean, it's everything you need. The Donnie going down an ooze slide right there. It's unbelievable. This is to get this thing in the box, man. I was like shaking once Dude, it was. I can imagine. So yeah, it'll go up for sale this week. I, I'm pretty certain by the time you guys watch this video, it, this will be gone. The more right? than it, likely. I mean, I've already had people hitting me yeah. up like from all over the world wanting it. So yeah, I got to get it in the hands of somebody that wants it real, real bad, man. Cause this thing is unreal. So that's it, Joe. That's three. That's three boxed vehicles and play sets, right? Sealed boxed so that's, vehicles. So uh, this was my Friday. Yeah, this was Friday. Less than 24 hours later, a different person, not the same person, someone else yeah. hits me up. 26 carded TMNT action figures. Oh, man. And we're talking like 88 to 1990. So those yeah. first couple years. The golden years. So that's the next video, guys. 26 carded figures. And these things are some of the most mint TMNT figures you're ever going to see. If you like this video, make sure you like, comment, subscribe, stay tuned for part two, all of the Carded Boys, forget the outro.